we will start by sprinkling some all-purpose seasoning on the meat. We already have some wet homemade seasoning on it. We then add half a tablespoon of cayenne pepper. One tablespoon of lamb seasoning. One tablespoon of paprika. And then finally one shrimp cube. You then mix everything really well. You can use any seasoning of your choice. This is what I normally use. After marinating the trophy, I'll keep it overnight in the refrigerator. You then preheat your deep fryer and then add all your Allow it to heat for some time and then add your seasoned chofi. You then keep stirring constantly. You keep stirring it. And allow it to really dry. The chofi is now ready. We are taking it out. Drain the oil and then let it rest on the kitchen towel it's time to prepare the yam to fry so we'll cut the two ends off and then divide it into four if you are new to this channel please kindly support shikes kitchen by subscribing sharing of the videos liking the videos and also pressing of the notification bell when you have time, try this recipe and you will love it. We then slice the yam according to your desired shape. This is how I want it. I'll wash the yam off camera. I'm back with some water on it. I'm adding some salt. I'll then mix it to make sure that the salt dissolves really well. And I'm seasoning the oil with some onions you then take it out it's well heated so we then add the yam to it and you keep stirring it and cook it for about 10 minutes our yam is ready so crunchy drain the yam on the kitchen towel and repeat the same process until all is fried With regard to the pepper sauce, we have one fresh pepper, onion, salt, and tomatoes. Our yam and chofi is ready. We have some shito aside. It smells so delicious. Thank you so much for taking your time throughout to watch this video. Remain blessed.